Welcome to GRTV and you're with Ruler Krakalas, the KK Rock Chick. And today we are here in Oakley, Melbourne, Australia. Little Athens I know that it's called. And we're going to be giving away some Easter eggs and finding out how everyone is going to be celebrating their Easter. A little bit of street talk and some fun. Now we are here with the youth of Oakley and we're here with Bridget. Bridget, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Bridget, where will you be celebrating Easter this year? Uh, I'm going to England for Easter to see my family. Wow. And how long has it been since you've seen them? Since I was six, so I'm 15 now, so quite a while. Well, there you go, guys. You know what? You deserve an Easter egg. Thank you. Thank you. And Tim? Tim, are you going to England as well? No. How will you be celebrating Easter? Uh, just spending family time at home. At home. And who's cooking the lamb? <laughs> my mum. Your mum is cooking the lamb? Who's doing the red eggs? My mum. Okay, mum runs the household. <laughs> Tim, happy Easter. Now, here's a familiar face. Hey, Vass, how are you? Hello, how are you? I'm right, good, good, thank you. One second. Stephen, can we get a soy chai latte, please? For, <laughs> for, for who? For Rula, my darling, my love, my sweetheart. Cake I love it. Chick, whatever you Cake want to call it. <laughs> good old dream days. Yeah, Do you miss the days? days? Um, yes, I gotta admit I miss Oakley. I miss you. I miss the people. I miss the customers. Oh, thank you. But fortunately, um, I don't get to miss Easter this year. Tell me, tell me why. Well, we've been baking like crazy this year. Um, we're making sudeikia. I'm ah. sure you know, and I think uh, Nick's been out before, saw us making sudeikia as well. We're doing the same thing this year. Fantastic. So, how are you going to be celebrating Easter? Other than making sudeikia for everybody else. Other than cooking for everyone else, I think this year is all about family. Um, nice. Close friends and lots of customers from the cafe that I still keep in touch with. So maybe even uh, invite Nick, yourself, Thank come over you. to our place. We'll have a nice little barbecue. Vas, have a happy, happy Easter. Kali, kalo Pascha, kali Anastasi. Thank you very much. I got oh. <laughs> <laughs> Now here's a multicultural table. Hey girls, how are you? What is your name? Alexandra. Alexandra, how are you celebrating Easter? I'm going to church and having family dinner. And what's going to be on the table? A lot of Easter eggs. A lot of Easter eggs. And what's your name? Natalie. Natalie, how will you be celebrating Easter? Going to church and eating food. What's, a, what's your favourite food? Um, I don't know, but it's Arab food. Ah, is that your background? Very good. And what's your name? I'm Claire. Well, I'll be going to heaven for hot springs in church. Uh, which, in which order? Sorry, I'll go church first, pray, and then go to Hot Springs. Very good. That's a good girl. And what's your name? Julia. And Julia, how will you be celebrating Easter? I will be going to church and then uh, catch up on my sleep. And catch up on your sleep. <laughs> now, earlier on, I heard you saying to your girlfriend, you're also going on a picnic. Is that right? Yes. Easter egg hunting. Easter egg hunting. Well done. Well, girls, guess what? I'm going to make it really easy for you. I'll just hand some Easter eggs now, okay? <laughs> The one's melted. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Thanks, girls. Right. Happy Easter. Happy. I'm here sitting with three wonderful ladies with three different backgrounds. Now we have Signora. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. And calling you Signora, obviously, you're Italian? Yes, I am. I came out here when I was five years old. Wow. And you speak very well English, well, since you've been here since five years of age. How will you be celebrating Easter? Oh, it's always about family and about giving thanks, um, going to church and then we, we try to take it in turns in the family to actually host Easter Sunday and uh, we have our traditional, you know, lasagna and colomba cake and uh, it's lovely. It's beautiful to catch up with all the little ones as well. That's fantastic. And now we have our Greco over here. What is your name? Xanthi. Xanthi, how will you be celebrating Easter? Well, our Easter is a, a big event. Um, we sort of normally start a couple of weeks before with the baking, um, tureka, and a, um, which is Easter bread, guludia, church is a big part of Easter, and of course the big feast on Easter Sunday where we um, just um, break our 40-day fast and go berserk. <laughs> and, and that is a typical Greek Orthodox Easter, isn't it? Right, absolutely. And now we have, what is your name? Colleen. Colleen, what's your background? Um, Australian, Irish descent, you know, many generations ago, but Australian. How will you be celebrating the, the Catholic Aussie Easter? Okay, well, we'll start also going to church. Uh, last Thursday, I went to the 
my granddaughter's uh, liturgy, Easter liturgy at school. They did the Stations of the Cross, which was very moving. It was beautiful to see your little ones then living what, you know, the values you had also. This Easter is a, uh, like a triple celebration for us. It's my son's 40th birthday, my sister's birthday and my husband's birthday. So it's all within the one weekend. So everyone will come to our place. Now I've got four children, uh, six grandchildren. So we'll have great big seafood, meat barbecue. They'll bring salads, desserts. We'll have birthday cakes for three people. It's going to be a very big event. Then after lunch, the little ones always do the Easter egg hunt throughout the garden. So. It's going to be a big day. So three special ladies, three very, very different Easter's. Congratulations to your family. Happy Thank birthday you. to your son as well and everybody else that will be celebrating. Ladies, have a wonderful, wonderful Easter and enjoy your Easter holidays. I'm here with Denise, the proprietor of Nichols Cakes, right in the heart of Little Athens, Oakley. Denise, welcome to our show. Thank you. Denise, I love the shop. I love the displays of chocolate eggs and Easter bunnies and tzureka and candles. It must be a very busy time. Oh, it is indeed. Does it take a long time to prepare everything? It does. It takes a long time to prepare, um, but mostly you can't do much preparation too early because everything has to be fresh for our customers. And what does Easter mean to you? Uh, Easter to me is about family, about um, the church, the, the beauty of Easter is all about family, I guess. And I guess you also will be looking forward to Easter Sunday where the shop shuts down and you do the lamb on the spit? Of course, of yeah. course. Uh, we don't actually close. We're open until 2 o'clock just so our customers can come and get their fresh clicker. Uh, but I do look forward to closing the shop and going home and spending the day with the family, yes. Denise, have a happy and safe Easter break. We've come to the end of the show and we've had a wonderful time filming here in Oakley for our Easter special. And you are with Rula Krikalis, the KK Rock Chick. And we've also bumped into a family member, which happens to be Nick's uncle, Theo Tony. Theo Tony, how are you? Very good, thank you. I'm feeling very good after work. After work. Theo yeah. Tony, tell us, how will you be celebrating Easter? I'll celebrate with uh, family members every year in our, uh, you know, Stospiti, uh, all Singanis, the... Uh, uh, we have a speed lamb and barbecue, other things as well. Will you be preparing the lamb yourself? I will, I will. And will you be breaking those red Easter eggs? I will break the Easter eggs and... Um, have you won? Uh, once. Did you cheat? I did. <laughs> I had the fridge. Uh, I have the egg in the fridge. <laughs> On that note, guys, we wish you a happy Easter. Feel lucky from all the crew of GRTV. <laughs> <laughs>